Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Tuesday, the 17th of November. I'm James Spann. A cold night coming up tonight. Many spots will see a freeze. We stay dry through Saturday. Maybe, maybe a few isolated showers late in the weekend. Here we go. This is the upper air look across the country this afternoon. Very dry air mass and northwest flow aloft. And a cloudless sky all across the deep south. A picture perfect fall day. Temperatures are mostly in the 60s across the northern half of the state. Cullman at 60. Birmingham at 65. Around the region, low 70s down in South Alabama. All of these values right at seasonal average for mid-November. We do note there's a freeze warning for some counties tonight, and we're getting into that season where some weather service offices have stopped issuing these advisories. Some have not. Uh, again, you can see the weather service in Birmingham highlighting some of their counties, but everybody over the northern half of the state tonight will be pretty close to freezing tomorrow morning. We'll probably see some 20s for the colder pockets. Severe weather? No, not today, not really anytime soon in this kind of pattern. Here's the rain for the next seven days. Again, the big numbers, western parts of Oregon, Washington State, northern California. Pretty good bit of rain for the Midwest and the Great Lakes, but just not much down here. And again, this is valid through Tuesday morning of next week. This is suggesting amounts under one-tenth of an inch. Maybe a few isolated showers by Sunday and Monday. Tropics, Iota is inland and weakening over Central America. Thankfully, the rest of the Atlantic Basin is quiet, although uh, a little low-pressure area could form over the Southwest Caribbean later this week that will be drifting down toward Panama uh, the Gulf of Mexico will likely stay quiet for the rest of this week and hopefully quiet until next hurricane season. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 12Z run valid tomorrow at 4. Ridging building and another beautiful day. Again, we start the day around freezing. The high will be in the 60s. Same thing Thursday, 30s in the morning, 60s during the day. Friday, the high should be close to 70. Again, lots of sunshine. And as the weekend begins on Saturday, sunny and mild, highs 70 to 75. We note snow for parts of the high plains in the Midwest. This is Sunday. Moisture begins to increase. We've got a front approaching, and we might mention just a small chance of a shower, but much of, much of the day should be dry, partly sunny with highs in the low to mid 70s. And this is Monday. The front kind of comes in here, and it could kick off a couple of showers, but probably not too many. Highs in the 60s, and the front's going to stall out. We'll go to Tuesday. There's a trough over Texas, and that short wave will bring some uh, increase in rain activity on the front. So it looks like uh, Tuesday we'll see a pretty decent chance of showers not raining all day. Highs will be in the 60s. This is Thanksgiving Day, Thursday of next week, the 26th. And if this is right, the weather would be cloudy with highs in the 60s and a chance of showers. Uh, nothing severe, and then... The following day, Friday the 27th, a little wave passing on to the east, and the rain would be pushing out if this verifies. But again, this is 10 days out. We all know this could easily change. Rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble. Uh, the mean, uh, one to one and a half inches. You can see evidence well, we, we will begin to see some rain later this month and into early December. Temperatures. Again, you can see highs getting up in the Low 70s for the weekend, then back in the 60s for Thanksgiving week. And the CPC outlook for November 25th through December 1st. If this verifies, temperatures here would be a bit above average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. If you can, catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great evening, and God bless. There are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more.